Hey, it's Tom from Pack Hacker, and in this video, we are taking a detailed look at the Tumi electronic cord pouch that I've been testing for the last two weeks. So, let's dive in. Okay, so to kick things off, the outside uses Tumi's ballistic nylon that apparently they've been developing for years. It uh, looks like a little bit of a finer weave than a 1680D that I've seen on other uh, gear. Let me just actually grab a pouch that has 1680D. So this is 1680D. You can see that those cells and squares are a little bit larger than they are on the Tumi. So I'm not exactly sure what's going on here, but the ballistic nylon itself is held up just fine. Um, I also like the shape and the patterning that it's in. So you get this pencil case like size. Another thing I want to talk about with this thing is their Omega closure system here on this zipper. So this is a nice YKK zipper if we look down here at the bottom. And then what that actually is designed to do is this zipper pull is designed to come off or break off if the zipper gets caught on anything. So it doesn't destroy the entire case. It just pulls that zipper pull off. Uh, we haven't really tested it. I'm not sure entirely how it works, but that's the feature that's listed on their site. And it is pretty thin down here at the bottom. So I don't know, maybe it like pulls out of this little side gap here, or maybe it just busts off entirely. I'm not entirely sure how that works, but it is a feature of this thing. As for other features on the outside, we have the nice classic Tumi logo going on here. And then just again, some of this stitching and shaping uh, just makes things look pretty nice. And overall, I found this to be a really nice size to pack. I'm testing the Bellroy uh, Venture backpack right now. And one of the things that I like is when you bust this open, you have these interior water bottle pockets. So on this side right here, I can actually slide this thing very nicely inside of this interior slide pocket. And it works very nicely because I have my dop kit on this side, my tech kit on this side. I always know where they're gonna be and I can quickly grab them and access them. Let me just zip this up and then set it off to the side. And I'll show you what's inside of the bag next. All right, so here's everything I have inside of my tech kit at the moment. And I just wanna talk about the inside of this before we pack it up. So there's a slightly swishy material here, if you can hear that on the mic. It's got this kind of grid pattern that I've seen on a lot of other Tumi products, but it is black. So I'm gonna be able to see these white items nice and easily inside, but the black ones, not so much. I did bring a couple of other tech kits that I wanna compare at the end of this video. So make sure to stay tuned for that. But let me pack this up just how I would with all of my gear. So it all fits nicely inside. As you can see, there, are, there were no internal organization pockets. So you just kind of have to pack things and layer them up. The benefit of that is that the items inside really take the shape of what you put, or the bag, the pouch really takes the shape of what you put inside, but there isn't any additional organization in there. So you saw with like the air tag, I kind of put it down to the corner. And one thing with that is that you just can't really grab smaller items easily and they can get lost in the sea of other items. So I do wanna talk about a couple of other tech pouches that we have here and why you might wanna consider those over the Tumi or why you might wanna go with the Tumi. Let's check those out now. So this small pouch on my right here comes from our staff writer, Eric. He picked this up for, I think a buck at a dollar store. One of the things to consider with it is the zipper is not gonna be quite as strong as it is on the Tumi, but I mean, it kind of is the same shape and size. And once you fill this up with gear, it packs out as well. And it's a dollar compared to a little bit over 30 bucks that you see on the Tumi. Next up, we have my favorite pack flat organizational pouches. These are from Topo Designs. They're their accessory bags. What's cool about these is they come in three different sizes. And again, they're a little under half the price of the Tumi and you get more versatility in the sizes and they lay completely flat until you start to put items inside. They also have a very bright liner on the interior, whereas with the Tumi, you're gonna see that black on black. But if I grab this piece of black gear, put it in here, you can see that it's a lot easier to see inside. These are my personal favorite pouches that do not include any additional organization, just like the Tumi. And then we have this pouch from Air on the side, and this is the whole kit and caboodle. There are multiple zippered pockets going on here, a gray liner so you can see everything inside. I unzip this and you can see that we're met with a ton of organization. So you have a pocket here, two pockets here, a zippered pocket here for smaller gear so it doesn't slosh around on the interior. And then you have these um, stretchy mesh pockets on the side. 
So I know Tumi is a very popular brand and I thoroughly enjoyed testing this pouch, but I wanted to make sure to talk about the alternatives to it in this video, just to kind of give you a bit of a comparison. So there you have it, the Tumi electronic cord pouch. Thank you for keeping me here at Pack Hacker, your guide to smarter travel. We will see you in the next video.